how lord shiva and mata parvati got married after the death of devi sati lord shiva sat in deep meditation during that time lived a demon called tarkasur he performed a severe penance and asked brahma ji for a boon that no one but only the son of lord shiva could kill him he wanted this boon because he knew that lord shiva was in deep meditation after the death of his wife devi sati he saw no chance of lord shiva marrying so he thought that he was practically immortal tarkasur became powerful and strong he started harassing all the gods in heaven in due time he captured the heaven and removed all the gods from there in fear the gods went to brahma ji for help that time brahma ji told them that the only way to kill tarkasur was marriage of lord shiva and parvati ji brahma ji told gods that devi sati had taken birth as parvati devi sati reincarnated as parvati ji in himalayas home narad muni had requested parvati ji to pray to lord shiva to marry her he suggested tough penance to parvati ji to achieve her objective on the other hand lord shiva was totally engrossed in his meditation but it was important to wake him up from this state of mind so that he could feel the love of parvati ji for him the gods asked kamdev to wake lord shiva hesitatingly kamdev shooted his arrow of love towards lord shiva the arrow woke lord shiva from his deep meditation and that made him very angry as soon as he realized that kamdev was the one to wake him up he then and there burned kamdev to ashes with his third eye but the arrow had also made lord shiva fall in love with parvati ji to test parvati ji's love lord shiva disguised himself and went to meet parvati ji he tried to coax parvati ji to not marry lord shiva giving reasons that lord shiva lived in cremation grounds and his followers were ghosts and vampires he told her that it would be better if she married lord vishnu instead but parvati ji was determined to marry lord shiva looking at this determination lord shiva was satisfied he then revealed his true self to parvati ji later narad muni went to himalaya with the proposal of marriage of shiv ji and parvati ji he praised shiv ji and convinced himalaya and his wife maina to let their daughter marry lord shiva an auspicious time and date was fixed for the marriage on the day of the marriage not only the gods came but also the ghosts and vampires seeing this fearful procession parvati ji's mother maina fell unconscious then narad ji comforted maina devi and showed her the true form of lord shiva after seeing lord shiva's true form maina devi didn't have any doubts on the marriage parvati ji married lord shiva after their marriage their son kartike was born who killed tarkaso to know more about this story please read shiv puran if you like this video please click the like button and subscribe to the channel and share this video with your family and friends please click the bell icon to get updates from our channel thank you